I often have to create slide presentations and I find it a complete nightmare to be honest with you. Actually learning the software, putting it all together, making it look attractive and engaging for my audience. And so when I saw that this software plus AI, and there's a link underneath the video if you want to take a look at it, has had over a million installs and actually works with PowerPoint and Google Slides so I don't have to learn a whole new platform to produce slides, I was interested in trying it out. So in this video, I'm going to create a couple of PowerPoints using Plus AI to do all of the work for me. And let's see just how good this software really is. Now, the first thing you're going to have to do to get started is to sign up and choose whether you want to do that with Google or signing up with your Microsoft account. I've chose Microsoft because I'm going to be using PowerPoint with Plus AI for this demonstration. And then once you've done that, you'll be given the choice whether you want to install the plugin for Google Slides or of course Microsoft's PowerPoint and then I'm just going to click install plus AI here it is I'm going to click install add-on and then it shows you exactly how to go ahead and do that and in the case of PowerPoint it's dead easy you're literally adding a native plugin to the PowerPoint and I'll show you how to do that in a second but they do give you full instructions right here so what you'll want to do is just to open up your PowerPoint and then go to add-ins and then do a search for plus AI for PowerPoint which you can see right there at the top nice and easy and click add and then that will then put plus AI straight into here and all we've got to do then is just sign in in exactly the same way as we did just now to sign up for our account and that's going to connect your PowerPoint with plus AI so now comes the fun bit we have plus AI on the right hand side all within our nice familiar PowerPoint and we can click here where it says new presentation and now we've got a whole load of new options right here so we can go ahead and use a prompt to create the slides we can start from a template just here and there's loads of different ones there's insight modern simple notebook and so on we've got more templates down here new consulting ones professional just about every template for almost everything you could imagine and um, if I just go to new and I'm going to use a prompt to kick things off to create a presentation for us this one is going to be on from chat GPT to self-driving trucks how AI is learning the road so there you go so I've put my prompt in we've got the ability to put in a ton of information to create a presentation by the way so you're not limited at all really here I've put in 1810 characters and created a really decent prompt that I feel would do a good job then at the top uh, you can choose the language that you would like this presentation to be created in and the number of slides and then that's pretty much it we can generate the outline now let's press the magic button and it will read that prompt and then literally create all of the content for that presentation and put it into a nice neat ordered format that we get to choose and approve and there it is look at that these are all of the slides the individual slides for this presentation um, there's the the title slide uh, AI on the road uh, driving AI versus language models all sorts of great stuff for my presentation and then I can just literally click the word generate presentation and it will fill out all of those slides in PowerPoint and make it for us in seconds turning you into a complete rock star of slide presentation and there we go look at that it's literally done it in I would say probably one minute maximum we've got a brilliant title slide there with the date on and everything we've got AI on the road more than words and then it's got some great bullet points there look at this AI versus language models all, all all interesting stuff if you're a complete nerd like me how driving AI learns data collection labeling simulation training this is ready to go if I wanted to explain the whole concept of what's happening with AI on the road for you know uh, self-driving vehicles I could literally use this right now press play and talk through this whole presentation and I did it in minutes as you can see even we've got like charts here as well which look great simulation hours versus road miles tested look at that and then we've got, it's generated images here for us as well perfect lane changes highway merging I mean it would be a job to do this now what do you think how long would this have taken a normal human being to do put it put your answer in the comments there I'm curious it took plus AI under a minute so very very impressive now if you want to go and make any edits to this of course you are now in PowerPoint so everything's the same you don't have to learn something new 
So for example, we're here, we want to add some more text. We can just go ahead and do that, no problem. We can change titles just here. Now that we've got plus AI, we've got a whole load of new options to edit any slide that we want to. So say for example, we wanted to edit this slide. Just on the right, you'll see it says edit with AI. We can uh, go and insert a brand new slide. We can rewrite any of the text if we're not happy with it. We can remix a slide. So let's try that. Look at all these different layouts here. We've got uh, ours is obviously three in a row at the moment. We could change that totally. And let's go for something different. Like maybe we'll just go for this one just here. We just click remix the current slide or we can remix the entire presentation with, you know, just a couple of clicks here. And there we go. It's totally changed that slide. It's added icons instead of full pictures and added some more additional content as well to fill it out nicely, which which is fantastic. Now, when it comes to images, if you're not happy with a particular image, that's no problem at all. We can go to plus AI and we can go to add images. We can do a search for any kind of image that we want to from all of these different sources here. But what I love is the AI images. It's fantastic. So I can just put in here futuristic lorry going along the highway through the desert like that. And then I'll use flux, just click insert new image and it will literally just make that image for us. And, oh, and there it is. Look at that. So if I don't want that one anymore, I can just delete it because I'm very comfortable within PowerPoint, stretch it out. Obviously this also works really well with Google Slides, exactly the same really if you're more of a Google Slides guy or girl, that is absolutely fine. And look at that, really, really nice. Very, very simple and easy. So slides and everything, you can obviously adjust the order in which they're in as well. And there's no problem there. But now let's go and create another new one. This time we're going to use one of their templates. So all we need to do to create a new presentation is just click on the top right here in plus AI and up comes our familiar um, menu here. And then now we've got our templates. I'm going to try and do one with that now. So let's go with this uh, Insight Modern. We'll click use template. And then I'm going to put in a brand new prompt. So instead of this prompt that's just here, we'll put in a brand new one. And this time we're going to learn Roman numerals. So this is very, very good for education as well. Imagine being a teacher now and you've been tasked with teaching your children something like this. How quick and easy it is for you to create a really good slide deck. I love it. And as I say, don't forget the languages up there available, French, uh, Spanish, Afrikaans. There's, there's loads and loads and loads of different languages. So no problem there, no matter where you are in the world in using plus AI software. Well, let's just click the outline right now and let's see if we're happy with it before we press the magic button and get it to create that full lesson for us on Roman numerals. And there it is. Look at that. Introduction to Roman numerals, basic Roman numerals, loads and loads of different things, and even a, a quick practice quiz at the end, which is great. Wrap up and key tips. Let's go for it. Let's have it make it right now. And by the way, don't forget there is a link underneath this video if you want to go and try out Plus AI. I think we've already seen that it works really, really well. And there we are. It's done. Again, in minutes, we've got our main title slide, introduction to Roman numerals there. Look at that. And there then just here, we've got uh, the basic Roman numerals exactly like we wanted, X equals 10, V equals 5. And then uh, how Roman numerals work, addictive, oh, additive principle. Okay, interesting. So I would say this is ready to go. This is fantastic. These little plus tips up here, you don't have to have those. You can just delete those off. They're just telling you what you can do to make your slides even better as well. But we've got like a full chart there. Look at this. Remember, I didn't tell it exactly what to put on every slide, it has worked that out from my basic prompt, just like you would prompt ChatGPT to create some content. You're doing it the same with Plus AI, except it's actually making all the slides and making them look really, really cool. So um, yeah, my overall opinion of this is that it works really, really well. It's very, very fast. And what I like about it is that it works with the, the familiar tools that we already use in offices and classrooms all around the world. And that is PowerPoint and Google Slides. Slide. So let's take a little look at the pricing now. So here's the pricing. Every plan comes with a free seven day trial. So you can try it out for nothing anyway. And then we've got our basic plan there, unlimited AI generation in Google Slides and PowerPoint. You can create single slides at a time. But for me, the best one is going to be this one. It's going to be the pro one. Definitely, I can see why it's the most popular. For $20 a month, you're able to uh, have 100,000K character prompts, which I don't think you'll even need to get quite near that but you can also upload documents for it to use to create
create presentations and you can generate AI images and then you can have unlimited uh, team members all collaborating on the same slides and able to access the same slides. So really, really um, inexpensive way to create slides very quickly. And with the time saving that it offers, obviously that makes it extremely good value. So um, once again, if you want to go and try it out, click the link underneath. I think I uh, really like it. I can see myself using this a lot over the next few months as I create more presentations. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next AI related video.